Yeah. So we, we meaning, I guess, like the hospice world would call it visioning. And it usually happens like a month before someone's going to die. Um, if they're on hospice, I don't, I don't mean like just randomly in the world, but if they are, we know they're dying usually about a month before. Um, but people see, do this all the time. Um, so it doesn't have to be a month exactly is my point. Uh, and they will see and talk about seeing dead relatives or loved ones. So it doesn't, have be, doesn't have to be relatives because whenever I say that, people are like, I hate my relatives. <laughs> I'm not going to see them. <laughs> I'm like, no, no, just anyone like you love usually. It's very comforting. So mm-hmm. dead relatives, friends, pets, um, sometimes angels, sometimes God or Jesus or whoever they associate with uh you know, that whatever religion they are, it doesn't have to be Jesus. But um, yeah, so they will see them. Um, sometimes it's in dreams, but usually it's like actually seeing them. Oh, they're usually awake. Actual, yeah, they're awake and usually very lucid. And um, it just happens so much that we actually educate about it. So people and family members aren't afraid because it never fails. We get a call, you know, my dad's hallucinating. He's telling me he's seeing his parents and and then I get there and he's like not hallucinating and he seems very alert and oriented is actually comforted the fact that like his parents came to him and said hey don't worry about everything we'll come and get you <laughs> like you know it's so and then I have to explain to them like oh this is actually just visioning and um and never fails people always think well, one, they always think, because um, those are the videos that always go viral on my TikTok and people, so when anything's viral, you get a bunch of negative stuff too. Naturally. So people always think that I am trying to push the agenda of like an afterlife or, and it's it's not. I mean, I have no clue what happens after we die. Um, but I do know that witnessing people die over and over again, because I do, I'm a hospice nurse, um, this is a thing that happens and it happens a lot. I mean, definitely more than 50% of people wow. um, it happens with or it happens to. And then they say, well, it's probably because of the drugs. And um, no, they're usually not on drugs. Um, or if they are, that, that those drugs don't cause hallucinations. So it's it's never anything that's like confusing or they're agitated because there are, so let me just differentiate, like show you the difference. Um, and then I'll be done. <laughs> it's a long winded answer. Don't but stop. Like, <laughs> people with like, um, so people with like dementia, right. They already, they already have, uh, agitation sometimes and they will see like pets or spiders or, you know, they might be agitated by it. That's much different than visioning. And people with dementia can also have visions. So it's, it's, and it's the difference is they're pleasant and they're happy about it and they feel comforted by it. So it's not, um, if someone's agitated by it, uh, that's usually some kind of agitation or delirium. Delirium is usually associated with like fear and anxiety and agitation mm. um, versus this very clear idea of like mom's here. She's telling me it's okay. Um, so that's that's the difference, and it's amazing. Thank you.